Hey guys, you're watching for the dog channel. This video will be helpful for all dog owners. What should you do if you find a mite or tick that has already bit your dog? How to avoid babyrliosis in dogs? So let's begin. The primary condition is time. You can help your dog in the first 72 hours after a bite. This is a period when preventive measures can help. So you have only two options. Option number one, preventive, one-time antibiotic shot, dose to clean blood from my toxin. Option number two, wait and threaten in your dog for a week or two. The last option is harder for the dog's health due to toxic effect on the liver. Bites of infected ticks do not go unnoticed for the health of the animals, and the first organ that suffers is the liver. But not of every mite or tick usually carries babyrliosis. That means your dog may not get sick. It's like play Russian roulette. Gun may not fire, but risks are too high. So it's only up to you which option you choose. I will explain step-by-step -step actions and doses for option number one in just one second. At this point, many might say that the right thing to do is to take the dog to the vet. And you would be correct, but only partially. Let me explain what the procedure is at the veterinary clinic. First, vet will ask you about the symptoms, when the bite happened and in most cases send you back home before first signs. Lethargy, dark urine and refusal of water. Not all clinics will also allow you to have the tick itself tested to find it out it was infected or not. If you save the tick for future test and if the clinic does such a test. In both cases you lose 72 hours, so only option number 2 has left, waiting for symptoms and hope for the best. But I will provide you with an alternative option. Once you have a tick on your dog, you will need to first carefully remove it so the tick's head doesn't remain under the dog skin. If the tick is large in size, is it has already drunk blood and you probably found it after one or two days on your dog. Second, treat and disinfect the bite site well. Pay attention how much the bite site bothers the animal. Does the dog continue to eat, drink and play usually? If not, get him to the vet right away. Third, if everything else is alright, give your dog a single antibiotic dose in the form of a shot or a pill. You will need a doxycycline antibiotic. Dose calculation is simple. 5 mg of doxycycline per 1 kilo of dog's body weight. So if you have a 10 kilo dog, the dosage will be 50 mg of doxycycline. One time shoot or pill as a preventive measure. But remember, a one time dose will work only during the first 72 hours period. And the time is primary as set as I mentioned before. Many of you didn't want to make it yourself, so I propose you to ask your vet to give a dog this one-time shot of dexetoclin to make sure you will help your dog avoid symptoms, symptoms of harmful babyrliosis disease. And it's only up to you to decide. Options are on table and you already know what you can do to help your pet. If this episode was helpful, feel free to support my channel. Links as usually posted below. Have a great day. See you next week. Bye.